Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Hallelujah. This is Kathy Brox for LUTG Radio. Amen, amen. On this uh, day 13, 2012, it's 6 a.m. in the morning, y'all. Amen, amen, amen. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Wakey, wakey. Amen. Jesus loves you. So do I. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things unseen. For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believe in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but that through him the world might be saved. Amen. And Jesus said unto them, If thou canst believe, all things are possible to him that believes. Ooh, we, I'm receiving it. How about y'all? I hope so, I hope so. All right, y'all, let's get it going. Let's get it going. Here we go. Good morning, Jehovah. Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. We hear from God and are led by the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, fill our lives and surround us with your presence. Thank you, Lord, for your order, the sacrifice of your son, Jesus, and his holy and perfect blood. Thank you for our comfort of the Holy Spirit who leads us into all righteousness. Thank you, Lord. For you are hope. We shall keep your word in our hearts and minds. We shall love you, Lord, with all our hearts, minds, souls, and strength. Today, Lord, we shall honor you by loving our neighbors. We are blessed to be a blessing. Thank you, Lord, for every mountain is moved and every closed or blocked door that has hindered the preaching of the gospel of Jesus Christ is open. We are healed in our minds and uh, in our minds. Any disease or virus that touches our bodies dies instantly. The addicted are delivered now. The hungry hunger no more. Our shoes are replenished and resources never exhausting. For you, Lord Jehovah, our husband made us rich. Your voice is the only one we follow. Your Holy Spirit leads us into all righteousness. We are always in the right place at the right time. We sow into good soil and reap abundantly. Everything we touch is turns to gold. We sow seeds of faith daily and harvest seeds already sown. Our spirits and bodies are not dumping grounds. Hallelujah. No weapons formed against us shall prosper. We are all we, we are the beloved. Believing you love us and receiving your love, not subject to temptations, submitting to your will, receiving your blessing in the name of your risen son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. For we always have more than enough all the time. Amen. The kingdom of God is manifested in the earth and the redeemed people of God. Hallelujah. The kingdom of God is manifested in the earth among the redeemed people of God. God's people ask for wisdom and receive it in abundance. God's people operate in the power of God. God's people have assured dwellings and quiet resting places. God's people are the created and matter in the earth. God's people light shines in all the earth with the help of the Holy Ghost and the angels of the kingdom of God. God's people are made to live according to God's world. The one man cannot see. If God be for his people, who can be against us? No one. God's people do not take the attitude of defeat. Those who accept defeat do not know who they are, nor their position in the kingdom of heaven. We, the people of God, are the heads and not the tails, above and not beneath, going forward and not backwards. The beloved and the sign of God, we count it all joy when we go up against the giant. We ask God for wisdom and receive it abundantly, standing on the word of the kingdom for all things. We as God's people stand on the word of God, and all we believe lines up with the word of God by his divine righteous order. God brings us his people health and healing and reveals to us the abundance of peace and truth. The hope God gives us is achieved and manifested in the earth. We worship God of our own free will, not by force or shame, but by love and honor in the name of God's risen son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Our Lord and Savior. Amen. And Jesus said unto his disciples, Most assuredly, I say to you, He who believes in me, the works that I do, he will do also, and greater works than these, he will do because I go to my Father. Amen. To God be all the glory. Hallelujah. For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believe in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. God didn't send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that through him, the world might be saved. That is absolutely for me and for you. Amen. We're the Jews and the Gentiles. Yes, yes. I like being adopted into the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. 
God loves us, y'all. His love for us will never, ever end. He loves us. He loves us. He loves us. Ain't that awesome? He absolutely loves us. I, I feel so special. I absolutely feel totally special. Um, uh, y'all check out the, um, there is something here. Uh, there, Cutlass is coming to Chicago this, uh, actually tomorrow. You can still get tickets. The tickets are really cheap. Uh, it's like $15 for per person or $12, uh, for four or more people per person. Um, you can check it out on examiner.com, uh, under my column. All right. So, uh, yeah, check that out. Uh, they, it, the name of the tour is called The Reason Christmas Tour. It's a really good tour. Um, they got new songs, and uh, they, they are working on um, teaching uh, youth to uh, present the gospel, the good news. It's through a program called Pulse, Pulse Movement. You can, all, you can check all that out on examiner.com. I'll put the link up for you. But, yeah, they they doing it up. I like that. All right, so that's Cutlass, the band Cutlass, and they're doing the Christmas, uh, the Reason Christmas Tour. And you can check them out tomorrow. Uh, they'll actually be in Naperville, but you can get all the address and information uh, on the article. And I'll put that article up um, on Facebook, and uh, I'll put it up on uh, the chat. I'll put the link up for you. So definitely check that out. Um, I even put it on the wall, too. I'll put it on the uh, wall of the station. All right. So we got music for you. We got an altar call in the last five minutes of the show. And remember, Jesus loves you. And and also, don't forget, look yourself in the mirror and say, hello, beautiful. All right? Uh, and check out my new picture. Tell me whether or not you like it. <laughs> I do self-portraits. Well, you know, money's tight. But I'm still believing. I'm believing that God is um, God is uh, definitely he's in the business of blessing and manifesting the blessing. And I'm believing that... um. I'll be able to take an even better picture with an even better camera and maybe even have somebody else do it for me. I mean, God is awesome. I still got to keep hope. I know the fundraiser didn't work out. A lot of things I've tried did not work out, but I'm still not giving up because he is Jehovah. His very name says, I see and provide. Yudhe Vahe is Jehovah in Hebrew. It means, I see and provide. Yudhe Vahe. Amen. His name, Ru, you can also call him Ruah, which means breath of life, which means I came out of him. You came out of him. And how can it be that I come out of him and he not provide for me? Well, he he's the one that actually named me. Yeah, we all have a name that God gave us. Yeah, you know, our parents gave us a different name when we got here to earth. But God actually gave us a name before we came. And uh, he'll reveal that to us once we get to heaven. Yep, yep. He always finishes everything. He don't leave nothing undone. So I'm keeping a faith that God is um, going to deliver me. Amen. And uh, deliver me from lack. And deliver me from poverty and all this other good stuff. Why am I telling you? Because the stuff that I be telling y'all about the different free things to do and about welfare and stuff. I'm in the same situation. Like how can she be on radio and be getting food stamps? Well, I applied for jobs and applied for jobs and just didn't get them. Uh, for whatever reason, um, whether it was through church, whether it's through uh, a secular company, you know, and 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 sometimes it was just people. Um, they they were listening. They'll, they'll listen to rumors, or like for example, when I worked, I worked at a, a company. I'm not going to say the name of the company, but um, um, someone wanted to get their their uh, friend hired, and in order to do that, they had to badmouth the the better candidate in order to get their friend higher. Eh. So that stuff still happens today. So um, even though you know when they do a background check, um, they'll see that the better person has a clean record, no nothing. But the person that uh, got hi like at this other company, the person that got hired, they even went so far as to bring a gun to work, and they were going to hurt somebody. And uh, they had already had a bad record. They had a police record. Now I'm not. I'm. I don't harp on people that have a past. I'm. You know. I only focus on what decisions do you make today. That's my focus. Okay, you did some stupid things in the past. Much love, all is forgiven. But when you've been given a shot to to succeed, and instead of 
going for that shot and believing that you deserve that shot, you fall back into your old ways. That's stupid. But uh, so the person when she when she did that, um, they uh, they didn't fire. <laughs> they just moved her. Weird. So nepotism and cronyism, all that stuff still exists. But you just gotta keep the faith, no matter what. No matter what, I mean, I, I, I even found a knife uh, at somebody's desk. I mean, a big one, too. And I'm like, wow, how can they bring all these weapons into work? You know, guns, knives. I'm like, what they afraid of? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, and that person didn't get on any probation or fired either. And I'm like, why are you guys bringing this stuff to work? I, you know, I didn't even want to get the dude fired. I was just like, hey, yo. Um, I don't know what this person is into or nothing, but I'm like, what is a six inch blade doing here? And I, and I did it real, I did it real quiet. I was like, look, just talk to him and tell him don't bring this into work because he can get fired for this. Now, true enough, I went to his manager, but his manager was cool. So that's the only reason why I went to his manager because I knew his manager wasn't going to fire him. He would just, he just took him to the side and said, hey, you know, X, Y, Z, blah, blah, blah. Don't bring that crap in here no more. You know, so, you know, you got, sometimes you got to exercise love in situations where, you know what I'm saying, because people got, they got kids, they got family, and even when they don't have kids, they got to pay for rent and have a place to stay, so, you know what I'm saying, I'm pretty cool when it comes to that kind of stuff. I only care about what you do today. I don't care about what you did yesterday. I only focus on what you're doing today. Are you making good decisions today? De decisions today? And, that, and when, when you find yourself struggling with right and wrong, call on Jesus. Jesus, help me to right, make the right decision. And I can tell you right now, shooting other folks, wrong decision. Trying to stab somebody because you get mad at them, wrong decision. Look what happened in Oregon. Wrong decision. That dude shot uh, uh, two or three people, killed a mother and a father, two separate families, and killed himself. For what? Don't nobody even know. I mean, did he even know? End up killing himself too and shot a 15 year old girl that's struggling for her life. Pray for him, y'all. It's a lot of crazy stuff going on and it don't make no sense. When you're looking to hire somebody, hire the best person. Don't hire them because it's your cousin or it's your friend or a friend of a friend or you owe somebody a favor. Hire them because they're the absolute best person. Amen. Don't hire them just because they're charismatic. Can they do the job? Because charismatic. They'll be charismatic on the job, but they won't work. So you always want to hire the the very best person. You know what I'm saying? And and uh, put your own personal feelings aside, and always go for the best person because they'll always they will always look after your interests first. They'll put the company first always, and that's what you want. All right. So we got music for you. Uh, Angels by Red Cloud. <laughs> And I promise my king to take you under my wing Yo, I'm cold, I fall up on the back of the sand Who's passing and over my session He's battling an unsafe So praise eyes, place, touch, raise his empty heart face Hidden prison walls from the gates of hell Swear like waves of an ocean His verse is with demons with the chosen My protection of a section's a weapon As we step into the holy of holy Suppose me and me defeat Yo, it's not an option Since I'm gone, hear me keep strong rocking Golden winds bring peace the village won't die, pony smile, trophy gaze, sparkle dust, shine, sky, contrast, cloud burst, contract, those station, calm back, contract, con artistic, mystic, betrayal, behave, free slaves, rust chains with rain from thy father, trickle down below, halo, glow, sun rays make green glow, reap, sow, seeds planted, forest enchanted, protecting your mind with God given in hand. I take flight at night, use my infrared eyesight, in search of a place to perch until I find my next flight. I scan the land to see who needs a hand I go wherever I am needed On God's command I stand at attention I know no apprehension I am quick to make an entrance Whenever warfare 
this mission Fighting off the foes of those that oppose the one who rose I survive Guardian to the chosen When I spot my next rescue it's as if time is frozen I swoop down real quick like demons scheming slick like Rick might Little do they know that they're in for a fight Represent Christ on my desire. Represent Christ on my desire. I'm immune to the doubt, and I'm a 
like hell of the fools I'm going in with no regard cause I got nothing to lose I was given the plan, perseverance and power So I'd be damned if I retreat into a corner and coward Man, you must be insane, my passion can't be contained And I ain't asking for a lot, just trying to get in the game Listen up if you will, I'm trying to tell you what's real Only way to see a better day is up in your zeal For your woman, you kill the same woman you beat Ain't you really kind of tired of being viewed as weak? Why I lose the peak when it's yours to have? Thanks to all the ones before that open doors and paths. I absorb the bad to be replaced with good. I'm trying to do the best I can to help save my hood. It's a real good day to get some growing. To plant a good seed to get some growing. Send them a letter. If your baby mama need it, go and give her some cheddar. Good deeds equal good seeds, sprouting up good trees. Many second guess, but this is exactly what the hood needs. A hard dose of the truth, I'm screaming from the booth. If you ain't trying to make a difference, go and tie the noose. Your life yours to make, you live, lose, and learn. Just know the path that you take determines what you earn. So plan firm and keep your grind steady. So when your chance come around, you be good and ready. You only live once, that's a true fact. So do the best before you go. Saw a young team supreme is Ray Kills. We're trying to conquer the scene. Stress free, no worries. Sun shining when I wake up in the morning. I'm trying to focus, keep my mind up in the zone and keep everything progressing, rising with a steady flowing. I know that there's no stopping me. Mind on my grind, so there's no blocking me. Prepare for the future. Kathy Brocks for LUTG Radio, and it's time for the altar call, y'all, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believe in him should not perish, but 
have everlasting life. Now, y'all know that uh, I'll quote to you uh, Romans 10 and 9, right? Thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus and shall believe in thine heart that God raised him from the dead uh, and thou shalt be saved. Amen. And uh, I quote that from time to time that the whole uh, altar call is based on that. And uh, Jesus still loves you. His love for you still is still there. But I was listening to Kenneth Copeland yesterday and he says, you know, you don't necessarily have to confess your sins because, well, God is not looking for that. He's looking for whether or not you believe. So, uh, my, I've always done the prayer confession as, Lord, I know I am a sinner. Well, God is like, well, I know you're a sinner too. Because, well, <laughs> if you ain't saved, you're a sinner. <laughs> Sometimes my revelations are humorous, but <laughs> God loves you. God loves you. All right, and he just wants to know, do you believe him? Do you trust him? Will you give it all over to him? Let him uh, bless you. Because that's really all he wants to do. His whole, soul, his whole purpose for connecting with us is so he can bless us. Can you believe that? You should. I can. Jesus sacrificed himself on the cross. Because it was something his father really wanted. And he wants what his father wants. And his father wanted to reconnect with his creation. Beautiful. So if you want to reconnect with the Lord, you have a relationship with him again. Repeat this prayer confession after me. Lord Jesus, I believe you are the son of the most high God. I believe that, uh, the, that the Lord God raised you from the dead. I want to, um, I receive your love. Uh, Lord, I freely accept you as my Savior and Lord of my life. From this day forward, I give my life to you, Jesus. Direct me in all my ways and keep me on your righteous path. I have faith in the blood of Jesus. Set me in the atmosphere of learning in a Bible-based church. In your name, Jesus, thank you. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Facebook.com forward slash LUTG Radio. Click on the link. Find the church. Take the foundation classes and the intercessory classes. Um, get the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Baptism with water. Uh, the, the scripture still holds true. All of sin and falling short of the glory of God. That's true. And everything I said yesterday was true too. And every day before that was true. It's just that when you get revelation, you just you definitely want to share it. Amen. So uh, definitely come back for the next segment, which is my peace. Amen, amen, amen. And uh, I want to say good morning and hello to Rovette uh, in Chile. Amen. Thanks for listening, Rovette. Have an awesome, awesome day. Stick around if you can for the next segment, all right? Uh, it'll be coming up in about five minutes. Hasta mañana. Oh, actually, I'll see you in five minutes. <laughs> Yeah. I love this song, y'all. Break yeah. number, nails in the flesh. Said it's a real good day to get some going, to plant a good seed, to get some going. We all gon' make it. This some knowing. We gon' be alright. I'm now clear for everybody to hear. Ain't no reward without risking. Ain't nothing to fear. All you need is faith. All you need is fight. If you just stay within the script, you. Quite all right. I just grabbed the mic and nails flipped the beat. And when we brought it all together, it was something you need. Every word to speak, be a word from soul. And every night before I sleep, I pray I conquer my goal. Told my brother no foes, I played the hand I was dealt. To the haters land, low hope in the secret I melt. I'm immune to the doubt, and I'm with Keller the fools. I'm going in with no regard, cause I got nothing to lose. I was given the plan, perseverance and power. So I'd be damned if I retreated to a corner and coward. Gracias, 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 gracias. I just want to say this to Rovette. Uh, gracias por escuchar, Rovette. Amen, amen, amen. We're going to do this quick commercial, and then we'll be back in five, y'all.